There are about a dozen new laws going into effect on January 1st here in California. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price has a look at some new laws meant to address issues in public safety and the criminal justice system. If you haven't done it, you've likely seen someone do it, crossing the street where there's no marked crosswalks. Starting January 1st, jaywalkers won't be ticketed if it's safe to cross. Tickets like this can pile up if they don't pay them. They do a, uh, attack on fines and fees, and it does further cement a problem that the low-income communities do face in California. The new law raises a big question regarding when it's considered safe to jaywalk and says it will be up to police to determine fault if a pedestrian ends up getting hit while crossing. Another law that will take effect on January 1st is SB 1228, which bans police from using rape kit victim DNA in investigations into other crimes. I hope we'll send a simple, clear message to survivors of sexual assault everywhere. We see you, we hear you, we stand with you, and we will do everything in our power to protect you, to help you heal. SB 1008 provides free phone calls to people detained in California prisons and jails. In a press release, Senator Josh Becker says providing free communication with families through this bill can help incarcerated people remain hopeful and connect with resources that can support their re-entry, such as resources for future housing, employment, and counseling. In Desert Hot Springs, Laura Rodriguez wants to help facilitate these calls for her niece and nephews. Their father is currently in prison. I feel in my heart that will help him as a man to at least have some communication with his kids. Let his kids know, okay, daddy's locked up right now, but daddy still love you. Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3. Outside of public safety, there are health care and labor laws going into effect. You can see a list of new laws coming in 2023 right now at KESQ.com.